All right, Fight Life Media, we're here with the new 170-pound Las Vegas MMA champion, Justin, the Grave Digger Driggers. Justin, congratulations on a great fight, man. Uh, walk everybody through. We're going to show some footage here. Uh, a relatively quick fight. Walk everybody through your thoughts on the fight and how you got the finish. Um, man, you know, I was in the back, you know, warming up. Uh, Nick was uh, keeping me calm, you know, it was the 14th fight, and I was back there warming up with one kick Nick and uh, Dennis Davis, um, and, you know, just waiting patiently, you know, for my opportunity to, to fight, and uh, I think the ref stopped the fight a little too quick, you know, I, I hit him, and uh, I don't know, you know, when you're in the moment, you know, um, you know, I just... I feel like, you know, I could have performed a little better, you know, but I guess you can't ask much more from, you know, a knockout 11 seconds, you know. Yeah, definitely, Justin. You looked awesome out there. Uh, really, you know, your stand-up game is sick, and uh, who knows, you know, the guy that was in the cage with you tonight, not even the best that you've ever faced out there. Um, what do you think is next for you? You know, it, I think it's when you're at the level that you are in the amateurs, you're now the new, uh, you know, champion it's going to be hard to find somebody that can really stand with you and even you know your ground game you've got a couple of submission wins as well what do you think's next for you um you know just going back to the gym keep getting better you know get my wrestling better get my muay thai better get my jiu-jitsu better and working on getting to that level of being able to fight in the ufc you know uh, getting to that level the le that ufc level that black belt level that you know high level olympic wrestling level you know that k1 level striking you know just you know going back to drawing books and uh you know working on my uh craft you know so justin now you're you know you've been with las vegas mma now a couple times you fought a couple times for tough enough uh would you like to see yourself defend this title and then maybe go for a tough enough title as well um you know i'm gonna do what my coaches want me to do man you know i don't really even care about a title you know but uh, you know, uh, my next fight's actually a, a Muay Thai fight, and it's going to be, I believe, March 16th, you know, and it's going to be for, uh, I believe, the Nevada State Muay Thai title. So you guys come out, watch that. You know, it's one kicks event. So uh, Nick's throwing it on, and, you know, I'm probably going to be the main event. But um, come out, watch that fight. It's going to be phenomenal. I'm probably going to fight one of the top Muay Thai guys out there. So come check that out. Okay. Well, Justin, you're always humble. The title looks great on your shoulder there. Anybody else that you'd like to thank? Yeah, man. Uh, I'd like to thank Extreme Couture. I'd like to thank One Kicks Gym. And I'd like to thank um, all the fans out there, my family, friends, everyone coming out there. Um, thanks. And uh, happy birthday to me. Awesome. So happy birthday, Justin. And as always, for additional coverage and exclusive content, check us out at fightlifemedia.com.